Hey again guys. Today I want to talk about this rose. This is actually my rose. The first rose that I've been able to grow from seed. Uh, don't worry about the, my dog making noise in the background. She got a bunch of mosquito bites and wants us to scratch her. But so this is my first rose. I call it birthplace. It had a sibling that came from the same hip and that one unfortunately didn't survive to maturity but the seed parent for this plant was a rose i can best like my best id for it my best guess is jacques Prévert, or also known as cardinal song rose so and the pollen parent unknown like i have no idea what it was so yeah i took the hip uh grew this and yeah there's no fragrance very very light actually but it does seem to be growing in like a climbing type pattern much like its uh, seed parent and i'd like to see how this rose will look in full maturity when it's a big bush but yeah it is own root so like probably gonna stay alive for a very 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 long time and since I know that the uh, mother rose uh, can produce hips I hope that this one can produce hips as well and maybe keep blue, uh, breeding this lineage and I don't know just have it be my lineage of rose breeding uh, I have so many other roses in our garden here, so I hope through natural hybridization, uh, more interesting varieties can come out of this one. So, uh, thank you. I will, you know, I'll keep making videos on roses that I've grown from seed slash bread slash discovered. And hopefully you guys will see through time that they may get more unique just like how you know david austin's roses uh got more and more unique throughout his career i hope i can say the same so thank you tune in for more videos in the future